is general reading. This may or may not resonate. Okay, if it doesn't, check out the other placements. If you need a person's reading, all that information is going to be below. Okay. Right. Bottom of the deck, page of swords. All right, there's a lot of spying going on, but there's just no talking. Okay, page of swords, four of swords. Someone's just retreated. There is no communication between you guys, but there is definitely this person here who's talking, spying, keeping tabs on you, trying to get more information. They're doing a lot of thinking about you, okay? But with the seven of pentacles in reverse here, it looks like you have given up on this situation because you just feel there's something here which is just not, you just don't want to invest into this situation anymore because you just feel it's a waste of time. You could have waited a lot for this person again. I'm getting <clears throat> a relationship with this person, the connection with this person, right? It's something that requires a lot of patience. I feel you reach a point with this person, okay? You could have been more committed to this person than this person was, uh, not in the literal sense of commitment, but effort-wise, okay? But I feel that you put in all the work uh, only to realize that this has been a disappointment over and over again. No problem. Let's clarify. Tell me about the Page of Swords, please. Why is the Page of Swords here? Why is this overall energy for Taurus? Nine of Cups. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's definitely someone here who is looking at you as their wish fulfillment, okay? For the Four of Pentacles here, this person could be holding on to you real tight. But yes, you make them very, very happy here. And um, they're thinking a lot about you, for sure. Um, tell me more about the Nine of Cups. Give me one more card for the Nine of Cups. Tell me more about the Nine of Cups. Give me one more card for the Nine of Cups, please. Ace of Cups, ooh la la, nice. So yes, there is a lot of love here. There is a wish fulfillment coming in. But overall, yes, there is something that makes you very, very happy. There is someone who is definitely seeing you as their ultimate wish fulfillment, okay? And there is <clears throat> this person wants a brand new beginning with you, okay? And they're watching, spying, stalking. Not exactly talking to you as yet, but they're still trying to find out more information or doing a lot of thinking about what they want to do next with you. All right, tell me about the emperor, please. What is the emperor here in the past? What is this emperor here? What for the emperor, please? Emperor with the nine of pentacles, okay? <clears throat> and the king of pentacles. Looks like you were dealing, there was, a, probably you could have held a set healthy boundaries or there was something where in the past you took um, control of a situation, okay? And you probably cut off someone in the past is what I'm getting. And you chose to focus on yourself with the Nine of Pentacles here. And with the King of Pentacles, okay? This is someone who's got their shit together, all right? For sure. So you chose to, uh, like I said, right? You could have cut someone off is what I'm getting here. And you chose yourself to be independent. Your focus was your stability, your money. But you were okay on your own. And you chose to be single, all right? But I'm getting you as someone who took, uh, who, who literally like, you know, like, uh, who bossed up, okay, and made that move, and you chose to be okay on your own, okay? You let go of whatever happened in the past with this person. Tell me about the Queen of Wands in reverse here. Where's the Queen of Wands in reverse? Eight of Pentacles in reverse. So right now, looks like there's been some kind of head games that you're playing with this person here, okay? Again, Four of Pentacles. So there's this closed off energy okay like someone's in the state of shutdown right now but with the queen of wands in reverse what i'm getting is there's definitely someone out here who's either um uh, trying to get your attention or you're trying to get someone's attention but there's just a lot of um cold uh, detached behavior okay and there is a situation here which you are no longer investing into i feel that's you taurus i feel you're not focused on this person you're not focused on anything else but you could be trying to distract yourself with other things that are not very good for your soul you could be um a little insecure but all over i'm getting as you holding back from this person completely withdrawing um you know being in that very stubborn energy not wanting to open up so it could have been that you're holding back your emotions from this person okay because in the past this you like i said right you could have cut this person off okay and you thought that was something important too because this this was a relationship or a connection that was lacking structure and now right now you're paying no heed to this person here for sure tell me about the um tell me about the why the eight of pentacles in reverse why is the eight of pentacles in reverse you could have been the one who was pursuing this relationship a lot, okay, while well, this person was not doing anything. Why they open it? Oh, temple, see, this is what you're doing. You're just going with the flow. 
you're just being very patient. You're, um, I feel that you're okay with the situation of the way it is right now. You're just not putting in any of your energy. You're very withdrawn right now, all right? Because you could be dealing with someone where this was a very one-sided situation, all right? But yeah, um, that's what you're doing. You're going with the flow. You're being very patient. Uh, you have this very moderate approach towards this person. You could have been someone who was very impulsive in the past. Maybe there was like this black or white, okay, for you. It was like, is this a fucking yes or a fucking no? Okay, that's all you cared about. But now, you're in that gray area right now. Yeah, so with the temperance, like I said, right, there's a lack of, there's no resistance from your side anymore. All right, tell me about the king of pentacles. Whoa. Tell me about the King of Pentacles in reverse, please. Why is this on this person's mind? So the person you're dealing with looks like they're very focused on their money, their career, their goals. But this is definitely someone who's wanting to focus more on their financial stability and someone who just does not have a time for relationship. Okay, this is someone very greedy with their energy. Also someone who's lacking the stability and someone who's just not giving it all. Tell me about the King of Pentacles in reverse. Why is this King of Pentacles in reverse? Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, so there is someone here like this, okay? They probably want a brand new beginning with you, okay? After there has been an ending between you guys. Because I do see the Ten of Swords here. So with the Ten of Swords, this is telling me that there has been an ending here between you guys in the past. Like I said, right? In the past, you could have felt backstabbed and betrayed. That's why you cut this person off, okay? And you chose to focus on yourself. So this person is coming in towards you. There is an opportunity that is being presented to you. But what I want to let you know is, a highlight is that we do have an opportunity for the ace of pentacles but my problem is that this person is still not committed okay ace of pentacles is not someone who's bringing it to you it's an opportunity that's presented to you by the universe all right so there is a potential of this growth expansion something committed between you guys but is this person willing to nurture it that's the question tell me more about the ace of pentacles tell me more about the ace of pentacles we have the ace of pentacles and the ace of cups so there is a lot of love here that this person has for you okay but this is just someone. Tell me about the Ace of Pentacles. Tell me about the Ace of Pentacles, please. Tell me about the Ace of Pentacles. Tell me about the Ace of Pentacles. Tell me about the Ace of Pentacles, please. Six of Cups. All right. So, yes, there is a reconciliation, okay, on this person's mind here. After there has been this period of Six of Pentacles in reverse, where there has been a lack of uh, equal give and take, after this person was someone who was just not ready to contribute in this relationship, okay? And there was, it was a very one-sided situation, which is very obvious, like I said, right? But this person definitely has reconciliation on their mind. They want a brand new beginning with you. But again, if you're looking for this person to come towards you with a reconciliation, yes. If you're looking for them to come towards you with a commitment, no. Why the chariot? Why? This person views you as the chariot. So probably this person views you as someone who's very, very determined to move forward. Why the chariot? Knight of Swords in reverse here. Yeah. So, but they do view you as someone, you know, who probably gets into an argument, okay, with this with them. Or this is just someone who's holding back communication, okay? So, yeah, you're being very aggressive in what you want in your goals, okay? But uh, I do feel that with the Knight of Swords in reverse here, this person does view you as someone who's probably even sick and tired and fed up of them, okay? Like pretty much exhausted is also what I'm getting. The Knight of Swords, I mean, um, so he, sometimes what happens is that this person can be someone who's literally, so they view you with a chariot here, let's say it is, to move forward, they want you want that forward moment, but they could view you as someone who's having a hard time expressing what you want, okay? Or it could also be someone, you know, who's just um, um, running away from the situation and not saying the truth, okay? So like I said, they view you as someone who's not communicating the truth. What's the Knight of Swords in reverse? king of pentacles because you also are someone who's focusing on your work we have the king of pentacles twice so you're very focused on your stability but the, the difference out here is that they are more focused only on the material aspect of life you are more focused on the all over aspect okay so you want the stability the growth the finances the money the family the commitment stuff like that okay so that's how they see you and they're completely opposite all right in the king of cups in reverse here why is this in their feelings why is the king of cups in reverse here yeah, see, they're being emotionally unavailable. Why? Because with the fool in reverse here, this person could have gone through um, 
a huge breakup in the past okay there could have been something that really really hit them very hard in the past okay someone could have screwed them over after them being in a commitment with someone now this person does not want to open up all right they don't want to they, they this is literally someone who knows that there is this brand new beginning for them okay they are very tempted to make that uh, move towards you but they won't because the fool is someone you know who feels the fear and does it but this is in the reverse which means that this is someone here who has a lot of fear of the unknown okay they don't know what's happening next why is the fool in reverse here it's a big risk for them okay to open up to you emotionally that's why this person is someone who's emotionally manipulative when they come to you okay they'll tell you all the best of things again don't make me wrong there is a lot of love here okay this is your soulmate that you're dealing with they have this strong soul like connection to you but they just feel it's not safe okay they're, they're hurt in the past and they don't want to repeat the same mistake why the fool in reverse three of pentacles in reverse here yeah see that's why there's this lack of cooperation you know this person is just someone who probably likes to be on their own this is not someone who's a team work a team worker okay and they're having a very hard time getting with you on the same page or just uh they're just not being able to work with you okay this could also be someone who feels that you're too much work all right or you're just out of their league tell me about the hangman in reverse here why is the hangman in reverse here king of swords in reverse great you're having you're dealing with someone who has a very hard time seeing things from another person's point of view okay they do this person is making is, is they, they they feel there is a temporary sacrifice that is needed right now okay because again with the, and and that's one of the reasons why they're being so cold and detached towards you their approach towards you is very cold and detached okay so again there is a lot of love here but when it comes to their approach towards having a reconciliation they just feel the sacrifice is needed right now they feel it's a very temporary sacrifice that they need to do but it is very required right now okay probably because the person you're dealing with has a lot on their plate and probably they're financially struggling or they just need to put in their entire focus on their career okay why the king of swords in reverse I mean, so yeah, again, a lot of manipulation from this person here. King of Cups in reverse, King of Swords in reverse. Tell me about the King of Swords in reverse. Page of Cups in reverse. Yeah, this person has a is suppressing their emotions. Period. They are because with the strength in reverse here, they know that this person, this person knows that if they want to come towards you, right, they gotta open up. They have to open up like a can of worms, you know, and they need to say everything that they need to, and they don't want to be vulnerable. They are. Uh, beating around the bush okay uh, probably someone who likes to be chased also okay with the king of swords in reverse here someone who's trying to withhold that uh, communication you know because they want you to chase them but i'm getting someone as you know who's just having a very hard time uh, expressing themselves emotionally okay they're very immature when it comes to expression of love but yeah they are beating around the bush there is a lot of love here i keep saying that because i feel it but again, when it comes to this person uh, communicating, they're very bad at communicating. Very bad, okay? Um, this person feels they're very logical, but they're not being logical. They're just being harsh is what I'd say. Why is the five of wands in reverse here? Oh, the cards fall. What I'm also getting here just for a second is that they're having a very hard time addressing the truth. And the truth is that they have a lot of love for you, okay? And they want this with you, but they just cannot talk about it. Why is the five of wands in reverse? Why is the five of wands in reverse? Strength in reverse, yeah. So uh, it looks like to me that there, what what's going on behind the scenes is that uh, there's someone here who's trying to avoid conflict, avoiding drama, or there's someone here who's just not being able to fight for this relationship here because with the strength in reverse, you're someone's very nervous to take action. With the lovers in reverse here, you know, this is someone who's just not wanting to emotionally invest themselves into a connection. They want this connection, but without being emotionally involved. Why the strength in reverse? Someone needs to boss up, you know, someone needs to man up. King of Cups. Yeah, see, there is so much love out here. It is unbelievable. Ace of Wands, they want this brand new beginning with you, but they're so stubborn. They're so stubborn. 
they need to boss up they need to have that courage to make that brave move you know to fight competition or to rather to fight for this relationship okay but they're not doing it they're giving up they're trying to avoid anything and everything that creates conflict or drama or stress in their life okay um what's the five of pentacles in reverse why is the five of pentacles in reverse your advice is to get out of the cold. Why is the five of pentacles in reverse here? You don't have to be lonely out here in this relationship is what that's why it is. Why is the five of pentacles in reverse as advice here for Taurus? Hi priestess, trust your intuition. Trust your intuition. You're the queen of wands here. You're the shit. You're that badass out here, okay? Trust your intuition, okay? And, and know that whatever happens, happens for the best. And get out of that loneliness energy. Get out of that isolation. What's the high priestess? Tell me, give me one more card for the high priestess. Trust your guides. Trust your gut, what your gut says. If it asks you to move on, if your gut's asking you to move on, do it. Your advice is to move on. Your advice is to move forward. But please, the advice is not to stay in this codependent energy anymore, all right? Yeah, the emperor, take control of the situation. Do exactly what you did in the past here with the emperor here. Boss up, okay? Get out of hermit and reverse here. Get out of that isolation mode. Get ready to join the world. Go out. Put yourself out there. Stop being so lonely. Take control of your life, all right? And be more logical. Don't be so emotionally invested into this. I mean, if it has to happen, it will happen. Give this person some time, all right? To boss up, to give this person some time to have that courage to make that big bad move, to big make that big bold move towards you, because there is a lot of love here. They're just very afraid, okay, of facing uh of what will happen if they go ahead and pursue this relationship with you or go ahead and reconcile what's the next step. And probably they know that the next step if they reconcile is probably something serious because you guys have been through a lot together, okay. So there is no point of having these Ace of Cups and Ace of Swords and Ace of Pentacles out here. You don't want to restart the cycle with this person. Why is the world in reverse here? Why is the world in reverse? Page of Pentacles in reverse here. Yeah. So it looks like there is still going to be some unfinished business between you guys here, right? Because this is someone who is just not initiating the communication. Page of Pentacles in reverse is someone, you know, who's just not putting in the effort, okay? And not even putting in the effort to make things real. That's what I'd say. <sighs> page, page, this is, um, you know, they're not putting that action to make things real is what I'm saying, okay? So that's why there is no growth here. Give me one more card for the Page of Pentacles in reverse. Two of Cups, yeah. So what, what's the point? What's the point? There is so much love out here, okay? With the two of cups here, you guys are, I mean, in love. Emotional fulfillment, 100 out of 100, okay? Putting in the work to make something real or putting in the action towards stability, nada. That's why the world in reverse. That's why things are still going to be unfinished between you guys, between you guys for this way, all right? I hope I made myself very, very clear. I hope you enjoyed this reading. I hope it resonates with you. Do like, share, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.